1608-04 Venus Enigma By the way, I'm six weeks on T now. Definitely notice that my voice has deepened. These last weeks I watched many videos about non-binary androgyny and the last but um, sorted by upload date and just yesterday one video I want to comment on he criticized very much the non-binary community uh, he says they hurt the trans community so in his opinion uh, people should be sorted by only a m male and female go in one or the other box he doesn't accept a third gender like uh, just uh, the other day I had a look hashtag LTB sorry hashtag LGBTQ or Q is for queer but actually there is more the hashtag LGBTI which is for intersex people who are born okay a review but born intersex which is between male and female I still feel like the necessity to justify why I'm on T. I explained in English in video number 158 and in Spanish in number 163 and in German 162. And in addition, I want to explain once again <laughs> imagine or go through an uh, anorexia and suffer from the consequences from anorexia then you understand why I have a little bit different priorities not just to to appear uh, I I care much more how I feel inside than how other people feel when they look at me. They should be happy that they are not blind, that they can see. And <clears throat> if I could choose, I would like to have a male body, but I, I was born with that vagina and... <laughs> living with so many years with that female body I have uh, much more kind of female because in the end now especially being on testosterone uh, I feel <laughs> in the end I really have much more attraction to to masculine people <laughs> I don't care about pronouns and I really understand that it's difficult to to use uh, the third gender pronoun but uh, how he expressed this uh, prejudice against non-binary people I re the reason to why I like to use the name androgyny in the title of my YouTube channel is because I want to raise awareness and fight for acceptance about this third agenda and just consider the people who are just in the time of transition even if they uh, feel completely the opposite sex uh, <coughs> and imagine young boys before they went to the bathroom with the mother and uh, then they have to start to go alone to the men's bathroom <coughs> 
many people feel like, ah, uh, do I have permission to go to this bathroom? <laughs> and in the end, some got a bladder infections for...